This mission is really personally important to me because I've been invested in it from its start. Uh, I've worked on other missions before, the Opportunity Rover, the Spirit Rover, and the Curiosity Rover, but I came into each of those missions after the mission was already operating on Mars. Perseverance is the first rover that I will have been part of its design. And I work with the Mascam Z team. Mascam Z are the two twin cameras on the top of the rover. They look like this. And these two cameras have a set of filter wheels. Each camera has eight different filters. That's eight different colors of light that the rover will be able to see on Mars. And I've been part of the team that is designing the specific filters. So I have been selecting the exact colors that Perseverance will be able to see. So when the rover lands and opens her eyes for the first time on Mars, I will know that I was a big part of the decisions behind how Perseverance is going to see Mars. The thing that would be most exciting is probably the thing that I can't even imagine at this point. Uh, some of the most exciting discoveries of the previous rover missions on Mars have been things that we had no idea were even possible to be there on the surface. We didn't realize at Gusev Crater, for example, uh, where the Spirit rover landed, that there were sulfur-rich soils, silica-rich soils, the types of materials that form around ancient hot springs. We would have had no idea at this stage before landing on Mars that those things were there. So the most exciting discovery that I can expect from Perseverance is the thing by definition that I am not able to expect right now. Maybe that's not a very satisfying answer, but this is why we go and explore other worlds is to find what's out there that we can't even imagine based on our experiences here on Earth.